everyone this is inspired 2016 we would like to give you a free tarot card reading focusing on your love life and your relationship this tarot card reading will give you an update of your love life including your past your presence and your future uh, relationship card uh, reading so the way we laid out the card we will draw four cards for you so the first card will represent your past love life and the second card will represent your present conditions of your love life and then the third card will represent your future position of your love life and the last card will represent as a guidance card that represent the direction of your love life will be headed into for the next future so i hope that you enjoy the reading and if you like the reading just click like and subscribe to our channel thank you hello capricorn this is inspire 2016 with your weekly love and relationship reading for the week commencing the 13th of march until the 19th of march 2017 the first card for you is representing the past position of your love life your card is the ace of pentacles you might find yourself had started something new in your life either starting a new relationship or new job this card indicates the beginning of new energy and revitalized interest in the material or financial areas of your life this card may represent the beginning of new investments or the willingness to undertake a new business venture there is also the possible indication of a legacy or influx of money from an unexpected source the Ace of Pentacles heralds a feeling of prosperity and abundance and should be accepted joyfully. It is a very positive card in general. The Ace of Pentacles is symbolic of wealth, not just in the financial sense but also in a more holistic sense. You may see new opportunities come your way to generate a new source of income, or you may be lucky enough to receive a financial gift or windfall. On a broader level, this ace indicates abundance in all areas of your life and a general feeling that you are indeed blessed and deserving of everything that comes your way. Operate by the law of attraction, and send out positive energy into the universe so that you may receive abundance in return. The ace of pentacles is about manifestation of your goals, and that you are moving into a more positive state of mind about what you are capable of achieving. Your ideas are ready to be turned into something tangible. Figure out what will work and make it a reality. Thus, the Ace of Pentacles sees you starting to map out how exactly you will achieve your goals, by creating targeted action plans and getting those actions underway. There are opportunities that are becoming available to you that will help you to manifest your goals and realize your inner potential, whilst at the same time generate some level of income and financial support. You are beginning to see that the world is indeed your oyster and that through careful planning, you can manifest your true goals and desires. The Ace of Pentacles can suggest that we need to introduce something new into the equation rather than let things remain as they are, and hope they work themselves out. The Ace of Pentacles suggests you throw something new into the mix. Consider something that is out of character or something you might not ordinarily do, or get around to doing. For instance, you might consider joining a club, taking a class to learn new skills or maybe even picking up a couple of books to learn how to build a new business. The second card for you is representing, your present love life. Your card is, the two of pentacles. You may need to find balance between opposing desires and interests in your current relationship. Life will always be uncertain, yet if you can produce balance and harmony among all the demands upon you, you will ultimately live happily and in prosperity. Thus, the Two of Pentacles serves as a reminder to remain alert, agile and patient as you attempt to juggle your family, your friends, work, finances, health and new challenges. You need to be very clear on your priorities and where you want to invest your time and energy. 
there is a tendency to be distracted by day-to-day -day affairs and general busyness, so prioritizing your activities and carefully managing your time is essential. The Two of Pentacles brings you back down to earth and reminds you to not only focus on your broader life goals but to also make sure your day-to-day -day affairs are in order. This is a card of good time management and financial management, ensuring that your bills are paid on time, that you keep a record of all your appointments and daily commitments, etc. It may sound tedious having to focus your attention on these more mundane issues but this card reminds you that sometimes getting on top of your daily affairs is as important as pursuing your broader life goals. Sometimes. The Two of Pentacles can indicate that there are problems and difficulties in the future. There may be obstacles erected which hinder the attainment of what you wish to pursue or obtain in life. The situation may cause undue worry and again, you will be required to juggle your priorities and manage your time effectively to stay on top of the situation. Similarly, the Two of Pentacles predicts change. You need to be able to cope with change, remaining flexible and adaptable in your approach. Rather than putting all your eggs in one basket, you may be better to keep two or more things going at once so you have the luxury of choice, should one option fall through. You must stay centered while you stay flexible and keep informed. Look for new possibilities, be open to change and go with the flow as best you can. The third card for you is representing, the future of your love life. Your card is, the Nine of Pentacles. You finally will reach a point in your life where you are feeling self-confident, self-sufficient, independent and free. By acting on your own accord, you have attained well-deserved success and may now enjoy money, leisure time, pleasure, material comfort and rest. You appreciate what is now available to you, knowing that the difficulties are over. You also know that you can complete any work necessary through confidence, self-discipline and patience. The Nine of Pentacles is about enjoying the good life and the fruits of your labor. You have worked hard to get here, so now, sit back and relax and enjoy some of life's luxuries. You deserve it. Do not be afraid to splurge. Indulge or pamper yourself, particularly if it is as a reward for all of your hard work. Treat yourself to a special occasion, to simply celebrate the journey you have been on to achieve your goals and to re-energize yourself for the next phase. You are close to reaching completion, so acknowledge this and then prepare for what will come after. Sometimes, however, the Nine of Pentacles can indicate that you are close to reaching your goal but you have not yet made it. So, as a result, you may want to stick to your program and continue sacrificing until you have reached that goal. You are showing great self-discipline and self-control to ensure you get to where you want to be. Whilst the Suit of Pentacles typically focuses on material wealth and gain, the Nine of Pentacles also suggests that you are in harmony with the nature that is around you. You have an appreciation for the beauty and abundance found in nature and you are able to harness this energy to bring pleasure into your life. You may enjoy gardening or floristry, or you may simply like to pass your time in the beauty of nature with picnics or walks in the park. The Nine of Pentacles can indicate a time of restraint, poison grace. The figure in the card is very ladylike and refined. She lives a comfortable, luxurious lifestyle and is able to keep herself looking nice. This is a time when you need to carry yourself with grace and refinement, and to be tactful and diplomatic in your dealings with others. The last card for you is guidance for your love life. The guidance card for you is the music. The angels guide you to immerse yourself in beautiful music. Music lifts your spirit above earthbound concerns and elevates your thoughts to divine love. You have angels with you who want to help you through the healing properties of music. 
By drawing this card, the angels ask you to add more music into your life. They guide you to play soft background music while you dress, work, and play. They also ask you to whistle and sing often. You may also have drawn this card because of your own musical gifts. Have you felt guided lately to compose a song, participate in a musical play, join a singing group or band, or play an instrument? These inner nudges may be coming from your angels, who can see your God-given gifts. They know that your musical talents will help others. So, they ask you to be an earth angel by expressing your gift of song and melody. I hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get the instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, YouTube. Thanks.